Yo, what is up? D Man to Man is in the house, and today's story is about literally the worst teacher I have ever had. Literally the worst. Like from being strict to just being downright dumb. She was awful. Let me tell you, I had her twice. It was my sophomore year. I had her for geometry A, the first trimester, and then geometry B, the third trimester. Dude, let me tell you, she's the worst teacher I have ever encountered in my life. Let me tell you something. So she was new. She like just moved here from like out of state or something, being a teacher there, wherever the fuck she was. And she was young. So I knew she wasn't very experienced. So my first day in there, I'm like, shit, I'm gonna fucking abuse this. Dude, fuck me. Uh uh. Mm -mm. Dude, she walked in the first day and she was like no phone, no sleeping, no fun, take notes, do my homework, or kill yourself. And I'm sitting here like, I need an adult, please. I need an adult. <laughs> Fuck, dude. Hate her. Hated her. Let me tell you something else. The first day of class, I walked in here, I knew nobody. Nobody. Well, okay, backtrack. I knew some people. But we were not friends, and I didn't even socialize with them. So, basically, I knew nobody in this class. So, I had no one to endure this fucking torture with. And it was fucking absolute hell, and I hated it. And I want to say something. Our first test, the highest score was an 81B. Oh, I didn't do that. I was the second highest score with, like, a 75C. If, I, if that was the second highest score, and everyone else was below me... You could blame that on the students, or... Anyways, so, that's not even where the this, this story even takes place. Third trimester, or, yeah, trimester, right. Um, Geometry B. I get in there. I already know this bitch. And I'm like, listen, I don't want to fuck around. Just fucking give me C's, and we'll be happy. <laughs> Okay, I just want to get the fuck out of here. Okay, thank you. Anyways, first day I walk in there, yet again, I am in there with nobody. And what's even awkward is that there's someone in there that used to be really good friends with me. Like back in middle school and grade school. But like, there was a time in our lives where we just didn't talk because we didn't have classes together and we just kind of distanced ourselves. So like, we wasn't that close, so it was just kind of awkward. Anyways, I didn't want to talk to him. So, I was in there alone. Thank goodness, one of my friends, Sam, not a real name, but Sam, fucking, she was in, like, honors geometry, okay? And she just happened, like, this shit so hard, stressful, she drops out and joins my class. Thank God, we're in band together, we were friends, and she made that class Worth it. <laughs> she made it doable. Thank the Lord. Because of her, I got a good old class every day. Loved it. Um, but anyways, this teacher would like, hated her. Because she would come down. Because she came down from the honors geometry class. I don't think it's really hate. But she'd be like, mm, nice, of a, nice of you to join us down here on like lower level stuff. Nice of you. Shit, dude. If I was sad, I would have like, fucking smacked her nose fat. Just mm, get the shit out of here. We don't need it. <laughs> but anyways, so like, this, here's the shit I'm going to talk about. So like, I would say a joke, right? Or something funny. And Sam would start laughing. Teacher, bitch, and shit, would fucking... Tell her to stop laughing and to shut the fuck up. Not really, but she would tell her to be quiet. And I'd be like, listen, that's my fault. I'm sorry. And then she would still persist. Well, she still needs to be quiet. Like, it's, she still blames her. Dude, it's my fault. I'm taking the fault. I'm being a good friend. Something this school doesn't teach us to be. But I'm a perfect example of a good friend. No, not only that, there's like this other thing too. Like, listen, so... I have to tell y'all something. I have ADHD or ADD or something. It's cool, right? So I take medicine with it. It's called Vivance. 
yeah, boy. It helps me stay focused. It helps me not be so fucking jittery and shit. Well, yeah, I'm 20 years old and I still take it. Fuck off. Anyways, at this time in my life, my, my doctor was like trying to win me off it or wind me off it or whatever. What, win? Wind? Words? Yeah, grammar. That's cool. Um, Trying to get me off it. So he was like lowering the dosage. So it just wasn't as strong and it didn't last as long throughout the day. Well, this was fourth fucking period. Right after lunch. So, um... Wait, right after lunch. This was lunch period. So, like, we had some time after lunch. But anyways, by this time, it was fucking gone. So I didn't, like, care. I didn't focus in class. I didn't take notes. I was not a good student. So, tests would come up, and I'd be like, Sam, what the fuck is this? And she'd be like, Dustin. <laughs> I'd be like, can I just copy off you? She'd be like, yeah. I'm like, cool, thanks. You're an awesome friend. And I'd copy off her. And I know she ain't paying attention. The teacher, bitch, ain't paying attention. She's back there at her desk on her fucking phone playing fucking Candy Crush or something. I don't know. I know she ain't listening. Dude, I literally have everything she has. Like, okay, maybe not everything. I don't want to look, make it actually look like we copied. Because she can put one, like, two and two together. Like, they sit by each other and they have exactly the same shit. So, no, I would write... She'd write something over here. I'd write the same thing up here. <laughs> and then vice versa. And we'd have the same answers. Shit was good. Dude, she gets like a 92A. I get like a 61D. <laughs> D. <laughs> yeah, I'm mature. Anyways, I'm sitting here. Listen, I see. We have the same test. I know you isn't paying attention. You back there playing Candy Crush, ba -doom ding Yeah. Why are you doing me like this? Or maybe you're just giving her a good grade because you know she's, like, good at math and shit. Listen, that's fucking, that's favoritism. If that's the case, like, fuck you. I don't fucking, yeah, you know? Fucking hate this bitch. You fucking, let, let me tell you something, dude. Oh, fuck. It was a hard time. I just, I hated this. Thank God. After that's like, trimester ended, that year ended, she left, she moved away, and went to another school, I pity that school, fuck, this bitch, fuck, I just hated this bitch, I just did not, like, like, I've had some bad teachers, I've had strict teachers, I've had some very, so far, laid back teachers that, that push over to the students, okay, I've had the best teachers in the world. This chick was by far the worst. And she told the class once that she was, like, engaged to her to her boyfriend or whatever. And so they're like, dude, I feel sorry for him, dude. Fuck. <laughs> like, he, just, he doesn't realize. It's, let him come to class one day. Let him see what the fuck you do. Fuck, dude. <laughs> Math. It's mental abuse to humans, and that could not be more true. But the thing is, she made it fucking worse. It wasn't just mental. It was fucking, like, emotional. Because, dude, I will fucking know. I will say this, though. One day, like, during the first trimester, in Geometry A, I, I, she doesn't allow sleeping. But one day, I slept in that class, and she did not get on to me. It's, like, when I walked in, she just saw it. She saw the fucking tiredness. And my headache, the headache that I had, she saw it. And she just let me sleep, I swear. So that one day, I was like, you all right. You I. Right. Other than that, fucking bitch. And you can fucking rot in hell. Or burn in hell. Or, I, 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 don't, I don't know. Maybe she's already dead. I hope not. That's bad. I don't, <laughs> I don't want anyone to die. But she can, like, you know. I, I don't want her to die. But, like, if she stubbed her toe... I'd laugh at her. Or if she, like, stepped on a Lego or something. Shit. You know it, dude. I'd fucking record that shit. Put it on YouTube. <laughs> okay. Well, anyways. That's the absolute worst teacher I've ever had. Okay. I uh, hope you liked the video. And give it a like. And subscribe. Hit the notification bell. All that great stuff. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace. Woo.